this indecision and you can see here rabbit in headlights moment I'm sure you know what I mean by that when you you kind of just startled so you don't really do anything you kind of just freeze yeah um, and freeze is a, it's quite a common one in, in, in decision making because what, what your brain starts to do is come up with all the different scenarios of the decisions you could make and there's too many and they're normally problem focused and not solution focused so you just freeze at that point you don't do anything um, and it stops us from decision making okay it just stops us from making any decisions it causes procrastination so I've called this uh, no man's land <clears throat> so you're not you're not fighting you're not you're not exiting from it though you're just in no man's land uh, in this in this frozen situation uh, when nothing happens um, <clears throat> there's two things that can help get you out of this okay and again the the, the seven uh, or six uh, I've written six and seven on the next slide that should be quite interesting shouldn't it of what goes on um, the um, the, the six or seven things that I'm going to give you in a moment around decision making will help you get out of this freeze situation that you're in but there are two main ones okay the first is set a deadline for the decision okay so not 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 set a deadline to complete whatever you're going to decide set a deadline to make the decision okay so if you are undecided on something currently in your work or life set a deadline for when you are going to decide it now what that does automatically it might sound silly this but let's say i don't know let's say that uh, you've got a decision uh, about moving out for argument's sake okay uh, is it the right time to move out with what's going on but you want to move out do you not move out for the next five years and put an extension on your current house blah 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 whatever it may be right um, it could be causing you a bit of fight or flight whatever or it could be making you freeze right if it's making you freeze because it just seems all too difficult to sort out okay um, set a deadline for when you're going to make a decision not a deadline to complete the task that has to come later but set a deadline for when you're going to make the decision so you might sit there and go right by Monday next week we'll, we will have made a decision of what we're going to do going forward with regarding selling our house it's the same in the workplace if you've got a project on or this or you're not really sure what to do with that and I should I hand that off or should I keep it myself or whatever it may be just make a deadline for when you're going to make the decision just write it in, in, in the diary decision made for X that date okay now what that does is it gives your brain a target to walk towards to work towards on making the decision okay so that's step number one step number two is taking some action on your decision and what I mean by that is it might be it might mean think of positive uh, alternatives it might mean gather information and I'm going to go through that with you in a moment seven steps um, <clears throat> of decision making okay um, but I can't emphasize that one enough set the deadline take the pressure off start thinking about it but think about it in a constructive way get to that date and let's say you've set it I'm gonna make the decision on Monday by 5 p.m. or whenever you finish on Monday you have made that decision which means that goes away then you the, you know whether you've made the right decision or not well we all make mistakes you can't you can't all preempt the right decision um, brilliant John uh, I'm nodding my head off here thank you Fiona I appreciate that um, it, uh, it is a good little tip uh, and you know if I say so myself <laughs> if you don't mind me saying so myself uh, and the reason why I'm being a bit brash about it is because um, yes I'm teaching it to you but but it really made a difference to me personally when I was a junior manager uh, and somebody went well when are you gonna make a decision by uh, what hey what you know because sometimes when you haven't made a decision there's no way you can start planning the plan seems massive or too big or too far away or you know when you're going to make the decision by yeah uh, it's as simple as that uh, I've got a personal decision that's coming up uh, at the moment between me, uh, something in my personal life uh, and it's a lovely decision don't get me wrong it's a nice to have decision um, but you know with um, 
uh, with previous things that have happened, let's say, without me going into it in detail with ex-marriages and things like that, um, it's a decision where I'm going, oh, do I move it forward, don't I move it forward, you know, it all went pear-shaped twice last time, will it get... I've got all of this, these, these kind of decisions going on. No, it's not getting married, Fiona. You can take that right back right now. I have made a decision about that two times, no more. Thank you very much, okay? Um, but it is about it is about my girlfriend, yeah? Uh, hey, look, you're, you're all guessing. You're all guessing, Luke. <laughs> I love it. I'm not telling you. It's personal to me. I do share most things with you, but this one's mine, okay? Um, so it's about... But it's a nice decision to make, but again, there's so many things going on here, and it's put me into a bit of freeze, to be honest, about stuff. Um, so I have a date, 24th of September. Uh, we're all relationship counsellors now. Fantastic, good stuff, I love it, Christian. Um, by the 24th of December, I would have made that decision, okay. Shaving the beard, yeah, absolutely, John, definitely. It's coming, it's a bit more white now, isn't it, yeah? So, look, the reason I'm sharing this with you, and yes, I'm having a giggle, um, but I still use it to this day. Uh, sometimes I need to remind myself of it. So I'll get stuck in freeze for a bit and then go, John, just set a date. Set a date for when you're gonna make a decision about that, will you? Just set a date and get it done, yeah? Uh, I set a date, pressure comes off me straight away because I've got a date set in the diary. The brain, quite interestingly, once you take the pressure off, once you move out to freeze and you've got a date to work towards, your brain starts looking for what answers to the decision anyway.